Triple. Those are good. Those are good. Those are strong. This guy bet so big, man. Ooh, bro, no fucking shot. There's no fucking shot. <laughs> man, a lot of chips on the table. Can somebody squeeze, please? Can somebody squeeze, please? Maybe squeeze all in, Bradley G. Maybe T. Seguino squeezes. Can somebody squeeze, please? Better one now, one, better one, two. These guys don't bet enough, but I really want to check raise this one. I really want to check raise here. Come on, minimalist! You s It's not like I'm gonna lose the hand a lot or anything. I mean, I am gonna lose the hand more often than I was before, but it's not like I'm like so scared of this queen that's why I'm upset. It's like now it's really hard to win a really big pot, you know? It's really tough to win a big juicer of a pot now. Man, that's a really good river for me though. I mean, I don't think anybody bluffed. Obviously, I'd sit here and whine all day long about how like people don't bluff and shit like that. So I, I think he's gonna like check back like just like a queen way too often. So I'm just gonna lead for value because I counterfeit all of his two pairs and his only straights are king nine and nine eight, and he literally has king nine or nine eight. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Wait, how could he have king nine or nine eight? I, I, I have king. So he could have nine eight. That makes a lot of sense. But that is that. Does nine eight make a lot of sense for an instant check? Fucking click back. How can he have queens, jacks, or tens? I guess he could have tens, but wouldn't he bet the flop if he had tens? He literally just has nine eight, I guess. Or like, or like a five that he bluffed with, like ace five. He could have ace five. But would he also insta click back with ace five and nine eight? I mean, maybe. Should we gift it to him? Oh, okay. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. What's happening, bro? I'm like, wow, that's such a perfect river. It's like the only river in the deck where I lose maximum amount of money. How incredibly lucky, huh? Limp pot, check raise. Get wrecked. All right. Oh my god, wait, I don't get a mystery bounty yet? Oh. I mean, he's jamming King Queen, right? Which means he's jamming Ace 10 off and Sixes. It's pretty good pop. Bully mode! Uh oh, he called. I think I should barrel. A lot here. Fuck, oh, he does that? That's so big. It's very fair though. I should have barreled. What now? Wait, I check raise and now I gotta check fold? Should've just check called like a human. Or barreled the turn like a human. Not played the hand like a goddamn animal. Keep the good hands rolling, dude. After 400 people bust as well, we need to keep these good hands rolling. Fuck me, dude. Please, sir. Please, sir. Please have pocket nines. Don't have fives. Wait, he's bluffing? Five minutes later. What? He slow rolled me with eights as well? Is that at all necessary to happen to me right now? Man, I hope he has ace queen. Just give him ace queen and not pens, brother. Come on, brothers! And sisters! 60 off! Oh, man. It's fine, we're just gonna win. Aye, aye, aye. Sevens, bro. Come on, dude. Thank you. Thank you. Sevens. I mean, not crazy, but kind of crazy. 2688 and 2671. Dude, they better not make me card dead right after this. Right after. They better keep these cards flowing. These juicers flowing, dude. Dude, I'm 
Fuck off, man. With this. I'm just like a little tired. Can't just not be the deuce of clubs. He has ace nine of hearts, you know? Like the other flush draw. Can't just fucking not be the deuce of clubs, bro. All right, who cares? We have 910K, we're in the money. We cover the whole table. This is it. No bounties for me, buddy. No bounties for me, not yet. Nothing yet. All right, maybe this hand, if I can bust this guy after hitting an eight. That's a Buster's flop. I like that he's juiced it here with a 40%er as well. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Imagine he has aces. Man, if he has aces. Oh, baby. I mean, what a dog shit turn regardless, right? Because, like, I mean, unless he's got ace king exactly, but even ace king, he's going to barrel it off on a lot of runouts anyways. Whereas now it's just like he's just got, like, an overpair a lot. Ooh, jacks. He could have jacks, too. I think I have a fucked up amount of shit that I want to check on the turn. Maybe not, actually. Maybe not, actually. He's back for more. I'm just gonna put it in his fucking eye this time. Wait, he made it bigger this time? Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, whatever. Come on, I'm gonna flip, dude. A big one. Man. Put an eight, dude. Made a questionable PL3 versus the 3x and fought the open ender, so we'll continue. About a half pot wager from this fellow. This guy's a half pot wizard, man. I don't really have any hands to bluff, so seems pretty easy to bluff. Deagle Dan. Deagle Dan gives us the double. Thank you very kind, with Deagle Dan from Denmark. What a flop for the sixes. Mm. Now I really want to call with these sixes. Does he really have a seven? That's fair hand to have, for sure. I just didn't expect to see that hand. Oh my god, I need these funds. Okay. We're winning the flips here. Wow, so just 46 minutes left to play in this? You know what, guys? I'm gonna send you guys on over to Lex. The next day. Yo! What's up? Oh, here we go. We're off. Off to the goddamn motherfucking races, baby. Let's go. I'm gonna be crazy pissed off if, like, Yao Marcello just, like, lobs it in somehow. Oh my god. What did I say? I really don't want to get four bet in this one. Any chance at a 10 on the flop? Okay, interesting. Does he ever four bet bluff like any hands like that aren't like I guess he has like kings and queens though that I want to call against, but I don't think he bets 500 k with kings and queens, does he? Seems crazy. I guess he does? Because like it's a four bet pot and we don't really we can't really do that. What the fuck? This has gotta be it. This has gotta be an ace, dude. It has to be. Oh my lord. Big pot here, big bluff for us here. But I mean he called our 10% bet on the turn. You guys missed it. We were watching the all-in and the 1k. But I dunked 10% uh, on the turn after he bet like 38% on the flop, so a little bit on the bigger side. And he just called, which usually means that he never has a better hand than like pocket tens or jacks here, and he's like, you know, pretty capped, and I kind of get carte blanche to do what I want. Especially when I can even have like some deuce sex. Mmm. Mmm. Ace deuce, I guess. Mmm, this isn't that credible. Because 9-5 isn't that good. Queen 5 is, but. It gets done. It's not as credible as as I felt originally, though. Probably a lot more credible if the deuce doesn't pair the river, to be honest. Come on, these guys have been so active. Let's get a three-bet squeeze in here, guys. Come on now. 
Oh my god, double calls. What the fuck? What the bloody hell is going on here, mate? What the bloody hell is going on here? Maybe a queen of spades on the turn, mate? If no spades, alright, mate. Let's see what's going on. Let's see what's going on. Let's see what's cooking. I feel like I should bet a lot for myself at this point, to be honest. Um, just like with all range and good hands. Because people aren't going to bet bluffs really ever and shit, but... We do get a lot of information, I think, in this situation. I think I'll just call check. Pretty much regardless of the river. I think I'll do this instead. Kind of weird situation to run out there. Little Bobo 125 on the end, I guess. Ace Jack of Diamonds, Ace Nine of Diamonds, any Ace X of Diamonds. And then like Ace Jack Offsuit and Ace Ten Offsuit. I think I'm out, guys. I don't think I'm gonna pull to this guy. But I mean, I guess I am actually. Because he just has uh, the Ace of Diamonds, right? I mean. Why? Why did this happen so often? I don't understand it lately. Just like, we get like a really clean, like, bet big, bet big for value here with like the King of Diamonds, like the second nuts. Just like, almost always gonna make, and this is really nice. Um, but like, just get like a really nice spot, you know? And then somehow it just like evaporates into like some terrible situation. But yeah, that makes sense. Obviously that he was like bluffing. This guy's fucking nuts. Here it is. All right, we're playing. Oh, this guy can fold, I guess, but we're probably playing for two mystery bounties here. And the biggest one is gone. 15k is gone, so. Fuck me, right? Fuck me. One bounty and. Maybe I'll win the tournament instead. <sighs> Bubs. Don't bet, bro. Get a grip, dude. What are you doing? Seven. Oh my god, what's happening? I don't like it! This guy can have fives and queen jack, and like any queen. Um, this guy, ooh, that's scary as fuck. I think I either bet small and then fold or just check. Alright, we milked him. This guy rivered it though. That guy gets the side in the main. That's kind of lame, but we want a big main pot anyways. What do I need a mystery bounty for anyways, dude? They're going to be... Oh, yeah, $500. That's kind of nice, dude. I wish I had 500 bucks right now. I don't think I'm going to be three-betting this hand very often, but sometimes. Sometimes, for sure. That's pretty good flaw. The question is, do I bet a piece of lint or do I juice it? I think I juice it a little bit. I don't think I want to be lint betting here. Maybe I could check back a little here, too. It'd be kind of cool, actually. Well, pretty easy triple off now, considering a lot of my hands that want to bluff are, like, ace -X hands that have, like, clean run like barrels now, right? Like, even if I have, like, ace-7 of diamonds here, that's just going to be, like, a pretty clean, like, triple barrel off some of the time. Probably, like, ace-5 and ace-4 and ace-3 and ace-deuce if I have those ones even better, because pocket sevens might continue the flop, like, check all the flop and then give up on the turn. Well, I'm officially concerned, but I mean, he has ace jack, he has ace ten, he has queen jack, he has jack ten, he has jack nine, ten nine, ten x of hearts, so many, so many things. Baiting the snap is very nice, hopefully he doesn't like tank and put it in for my one blind with a better hand, but I, I feel good about the payment this time. Usually I don't, but this time, with, deep in the time bank, he's going to pay this time. I can feel it. Come on, man. Why do I never get paid? How do they all know that I'm a tight player now? Nice pot, though. Very nice pot. All right, well, we call, and if we hit a six, then we can check call all of it. Otherwise, we just check fold, I think. I don't think there's any sense in, like, um, leading again for 10% or anything. Like, I don't really know what he would, like, raise the turn with. I mean, he could with, like, queens and jacks and stuff, but I don't think he would. Um, anyways. Yeah. It's a good hand. Um, once the players are in the money, there is one mystery bounty for each player. 
Those mystery bounties are as follows here. Oh, and nice in the 4.7k spot. So the bounties are literally irrelevant now, guys. When you win a bounty, when you knock someone out, you get a random pull of any of these bounties. And like there's 150k, 5 of these 15k's, 28 of these 4.7k's. But obviously they're just all gone now because they're all gone now. I think I'd rather jam Ace Jack. And I'm going to call. And I'm pretty good. Whew. All right, all right. I mean, he snapped jam, so I was just gonna have like jack 10 or sixes quite a bit, like nine, eight even, but I mean, you won't catch me dead folding. Uh -huh. So our average uh, opponent isn't gonna be, isn't gonna be hitting all those check race bluffs and all those nifty moves that, you know, we aim for and some of the more elite opponents that we play against on a regular basis would, uh, would have. Interesting. I would uh, be, this guy's been reasonably active. I don't think he's been crazy or active or anything. If he was pretty active and, or I knew him and I thought that he could definitely be have a decent amount of three bets light here, then I think four bet jamming is like a pretty reasonable option with this hand. Um, otherwise, I think folding could definitely be an option as well, pre-flop. Maybe that's just like a good thing to do at this point. don't love our situation here. I kind of like folding pre more and more in these situations. Like I would have definitely folded queen 10 suited pre, for example, and like jack nine suited pre. I don't know about jack 10 suited, but queen 10 suited, queen nine suited. Like, I don't even know if this guy three bets 10s pre-flop, which is kind of like the range that we're trying to get value from as well, right? Like ace king as well, he could have me. Of course that one makes sense, but like tens and nines, he might just like flat pre-flop because he's kind of scared to three bet call there. Oni Linen, long time sub and friend of the stream, is wagering every last disc that he has. Well, almost. I'm going to force him to wager every last disc that he has. Good luck, good sir. Not that there's much bounty to hunt here, but I just think I have a good hand. Let's find a queen or a jack and eliminate the boy. Come on! That's five in a line. Unlucky, my friend. I apologize for busting you. Come on, more than the, more than the minimum. Oh my god, it's more than the minimum. Yeah. It's 148. Oh, sorry, Oni Lin and Gigi, buddy. Gonna be hard to win this one and not really a good hand to bluff with either, so. Probably just gonna lose. Well, that's a pretty good hand, buddy. Not a super huge fan of this under the gun race, to be honest. King 10 here. Not a bad turn. Pretty scary situation though, if he just goes for five blinds. Some of the folds that I like feel that you should make deep in these tournaments are so fucking painful but this guy's been like real relatively quiet he like three bit jammed on me once like you know wow what do you do awkward and uncomfortable huh title of your sex tape it would be for sure the only problem for you storm storm 96 is my sex tape would actually be with your mom <laughs> here it is here it is let's get it going I said you start with the getting the shove through though. So everyone's gonna fold. We're gonna get back up to 9.7 blinds here. And then we start from there, you know? It's easy as fuck. Oh, wow. Just straight into the double. Just straight into the double. Just straight into the double. No need to get the shove through. No need to get the shove through. We go straight into the double. We skip a step. No problem, right into the ace king. All right, are we racing? We're racing, right? There's no jamming. I'm gonna juice it though, juice it. A little juicer. Ride the rush, ride the rush. All in. Ace Jack. Get get him dead. Get him done. Get him dusted. Ace Jack. Jacks. Come on, man. Just like that, you can have a stack. You can go from nothing to something in just a moment's time. 
and win another 148 American dollars in your own back pocket, dude. Absolutely massive. 15 of 33. Whoever was just laughing at me, 35 of 36. Haha. -ha. I don't see you I'm laughing now. Man, I'd love to get a four bet jam through here, especially there's just Quasar. Or even have him jam and just have like Ace Jack. That'd be pretty, pretty tasty too. 40 million? I'd take 40 million chips for sure. All right, Tiago, what are you working with? Well, he's thinking about putting in more chips, more than just 1.24 blinds, that's for sure. All right, all right. I actually prefer to hit pairs, as opposed to having ace high, but it's all right. It's less all right now. Gonna be pretty tough to... Not a good turn, considering he bluffs with a four. Check, idiot! <laughs> I think the Queen of Spades becomes like pretty bad card now, right? Because we kind of want him to have like it was a fine card to have on the flop, kind of did some good things for us. But I think it becomes like a pretty terrible card quickly here. I mean, not necessarily a terrible card, but like it's not a good card. And like I said, a four is like kind of an especially bad card because if a lot of his check raise bluffs on the flop are probably going to be bottom pair, and those have just improved the trips and have me dead. So we boom down to 20 big blinds as the blinds go up, but not to be alarmed. 20 big blinds is fucking massive. Well, this has very swiftly become, uh, after I opted to bet again instead of checking, very swiftly become, uh, quite the situation here. Good luck! Good luck. Just have, like, King Jack. Come on, put a fucking diamond. Man, it just has to be the seven of diamonds, eh? It can't just be, like, the six of diamonds or something. This has to be the seven of diamonds. A whole thirteen hundred dollars be cash for it. Very cool. Damn it, dude!